again about Saturday because Saturday I'm going to close with the rounds. And uh, you know, I'm just basically monitoring, monitoring his, his training for the whole week. And right now I can see his rest. His rest is helping him, you know, uh, recover. And he's explosive. Right? He's very sharp. Um, I was reading an article about taking his part. Um, that's something you said, or is that, or that tip? Uh, I don't recall, but well, regardless, I mean, we're humans. I mean, it's just a matter if you're, if you're Mexican or you're not. I mean, at the end of the day, when you got somebody firing nonstop at you, I mean, sooner or later, uh, one of them has to give. One of them has to give. And what do you mean? that's what you call Sing your heart away. So, in this case, we're going to see who has more resistance, more stamina, and who's willing to stand there uh, and exchange for 12 rounds. You know, because if he stops, then that means he took his heart away. I don't really call saying it, but if it was him, he really touched his strike. Now, we can talk about being in there and exchanging for 12 rounds. Uh, I've covered Tim for the last couple years now. You and I know that uh, he brings different styles of advice. Sometimes he really takes the instructions to heart. Sometimes he kind of does his own thing. Uh, what would you like to see Tim in this fight? Like a little bit more of the boxing style, like he's able to execute against Marquez, or would you like to see him in there and bang and mix it up and rough up how Jesse Barnes? Well, statistics, the statistics for this fight, basically, we don't have that. We don't have that privilege to look good against like Jesse Marquez, like we did with Marquez. Because I'm just concerned about the 